Chasing the Wind, Unraveling English Idioms. Hello everyone, welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of English idioms, specifically the phrase, chase the wind. This idiom may sound poetic, but it holds a deeper meaning in everyday English conversations. Let's explore together what it means and how you can use it. Idioms are phrases where the words together have a meaning that is different from the dictionary definitions of the individual words. They are often used to express complex ideas in a simple way. Chase the wind is one such idiom that we'll dissect today. To chase the wind means to engage in an activity that is pointless, fruitless, or unachievable. It's like trying to catch something that can't be caught because it's always moving and intangible. This idiom is often used to describe efforts that are seen as a waste of time or energy. 1. In personal life, if someone keeps trying to please everyone around them, you might say they are trying to chase the wind, as it's impossible to make everyone happy. 2. In business, a company investing resources in a project with no clear outcome might be said to be chasing the wind. There are other idioms with similar meanings, like beating a dead horse, continuing a futile effort, or tilting at windmills, fighting imaginary enemies or problems. Understanding these can enrich your English vocabulary. We hope this exploration of the idiom, chase the wind, has been enlightening. Remember, idioms are a key part of mastering English and can add color to your conversations. Keep practicing, and don't hesitate to use chase the wind in your next English dialogue. See you in our next video.